Fort uh, North Texan is working to bring attention to a rare neuromuscular disease. We are talking about Friedrich's ataxia, also known as FA. According to the National Institute of Health, it affects one in 50,000 Americans. In the short term, a person with FA has difficulty walking, but over time, that person can develop diabetes, heart disease, and a shorter life expectancy. Right now, there is no cure. New tonight, NBC 5's Andres Gutierrez introduces us to a young patient spreading awareness and hope. Ready? And up. As a 20-year-old, Emily Penn is coming to terms with the harsh reality. She's losing the ability to walk. During the past three years, she's volunteered and helped raise money for Ride Axtia Dallas, a cycling event designed to raise awareness. But this year, Emily won't be on the sidelines. I would have never, in my wildest dreams, think I would be bicycling. What I want you to focus on is keeping your knees in. With intense coaching, Emily's training to cycle 25 miles through the streets of Denton. The beautiful thing about working with somebody like this is if we can give them a sense of success on an hourly basis, the benefits go for weeks and months out. It was through the generosity of the Richardson Bike Mark and the Texas Irish, a local cycling group, that donated this recumbent trike to Emily, and it has allowed her to regain her independence. It's opened so many doors for me. It's such an incredible experience. She, she set her mind to it. I didn't make her do it. Her mother didn't make her do it. She wanted to do it on her own. Her parents supporting her during this challenge. Right, give me five. Give me five. <laughs> Emily, I am so right. proud of you. You know, you have to put in your mind, mindset of you can do it, and you will. Just like in Emily's case, using pedaling as perseverance against a debilitating disease. In Richardson, Andres Gutierrez, NBC5. That girl has got a great attitude. And if you want to cheer on Emily, this year's Ride Ataxia Dallas is happening on March 23rd. For more information, just go to our website, NBCDFW.com, and search cycling.